this starship thing for it to look at and then come back and land because it was a sightseeing mission. That okay. sound about correct? Uh, it sounds about correct. Yeah. So if I take this one, hopefully with your advice, I can get over a million by doing these two. You sure could, but let's look at the details first. Okay. So you want me to open the first one? Yes. I'll come to that one in a minute, Tuplex. Sorry, Mater. Right, so this one is Rich okay Rose's. so here's yeah, here's the big things i look at yeah who who is it i'm gonna be transporting and this one says it's a chief medical officer okay so yeah. he's not a criminal Cri okay criminal the next thing i look at is everything in blue text this individual um is unfazed by danger um, they are on a time-sensitive schedule, and they're law-abiding. So, so, in other words, I can't really do any illegal stuff, or my passenger won't like it, and they won't pay me as much. Do you see where I'm going with so that? So, just for me, I need to make sure that I read this section fully to understand what I'm doing more than anything. And the top okay. one is just telling me who I'm transporting and where the destination is. That's right. Now, this one said it was, um, did it say a sightseeing mission as well? Yeah, yeah. So it's it says a high sightseeing rated it... contracts are offered. That's fine. So this guy wants to go to the row. I can never pronounce these. Uh, I think it's pronounced reort. So reort, which is the, yeah. the, the, the distance and the, the broham or bro. Yeah, so two, two different locations. A total of 240 approximately light years of travel. Okay. Story site. So it's, it's quite far. Would you say too far? Mm, yeah. 81 light years away. I would like to see something a little less, like say 80 light years only. But you're looking at about 250 light years. Get out of that for, one for that one i've got into the next one which is a chief medical officer again okay um unfazed by danger i'm sensitive again okay uh, low value target law abiding okay okay uh we've then got uh he's going 79 he's going to luge 79 plus 164 so it's about a, about the same a, distance as the other one just less pay question for mr x any handy tips for docking using hotus yeah i'll give you one of them do you know on the hotus uh forward and reverse set your thrusters on the middle thumb button the right and left and i use number eight and two to thrust up and down and left and then you've got your left and right on that one that is perfect it works great as soon as you hover over the top of where your landing bay is if you press number two your thruster will bring you down off that's what i use works perfect for me and i'm using a hotus i will show it you i'm using that you ready is that's that what, what you're works perfectly Epic UK Gamer TV. Thank you very much for the follow. That's right, yeah. And the one on the actual thruster is perfect for going left and right. That's right. So if you and then what I do is your number key. I just use number eight and number two for going up and down. Simple as. And he just set it in the um, thing. Sorry about that, Mr. X. No, oh, that's fine. But if it works, that answers you've seen me. It, wor it works perfect for me, that does. The only so, thing I can add to that is just take your time. You can, uh, Mr. Toff. You can actually come in at the right angle as well, as long as you don't hit the bottom because you'll get hull damage. And it will connect if you go in at the right speed. Yeah. It does that a lot as well because I've tried that when the buttons, when I forget to hit number lock. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so that's another this? one that's too far would you say 
Yeah, let's let's see what else is available. Anything else that's available contracts? So I think uh, Tuplex said hit this one here. Friendly. Yeah, they're all asking for friendly and uh, ordeal. Requirements not met. Requirements not met. Let's have a look. Let's have a look here. Two seven. Here are available. Here are this one. Let's have a look at that. So this one again is a tourist, which is a rich tourist. Okay. Okay. Uh, to Flynn Dock. Um, looking at this one, does not react well to danger. That's good to know. Laid back. Hmm, may be able to do a bit of dodgy stuff. Low value. Neutral performance and demanding high demanding highly likely to make demands while on board. Right. So neutral performing illegal actions will slightly reduce passenger satisfaction. But I wouldn't do that anyway, to be fair. Right. But it's good to be aware of this in case something does screw up and you don't get the full payment now you know yeah. why but this is a perfect mission i think this is a good one to start off with uh, take it's that not one. very far and you'll get a handle for what the passengers do when you take them somewhere so i, I think this would be a good possibility okay okay right so we'll take this one just so i can try it out okay pick cabin accept so we've accepted that one. I'm going to just do oh. this one to try it out. I've got this little thing flying around in his bloody room. Anyway, leave that. <laughs> <laughs> so before you launch, would you mind going to your right panel in the inventory tab? Oh, okay. To find out what he's carrying. Yes. It says... Ship cargo, materials, data, there's nothing at all. Uh, first, I've got three of three. Three of three. So you you filled your cabin. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Very good. All right. I believe you are ready to take off. Well, I want to check it. I like to check it all as well, you see. I just do this. Because look. You get what I mean now? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you can plan your route and all that. That helps a lot, too. But I can't see the dots or anything, because I've got it reset for the other mission. Do you get what I mean? Yeah, so click on the star tab and switch it back to realistic. Right, thank you. And it's here, this is where we're heading. Uh-huh. Right. It's only two jumps by looks of things as well. Yeah, it's pretty close. Yeah. Right, I'm off. I didn't I didn't fuel up either. Right. But I should be okay. You you're I'm gonna um... show Toff when I get there, Toff, I'm gonna show you how I use the HOTUS and what I do for landing. Just so that you can see it. And I'm conscious as well when I've been playing the game that I stick within the speed limits and things like that. Good for you. Because I have, do you know what? I have been fined. That's right. They're, the stations are a little picky about speed. A little? God say the worst <laughs> of the bleeding British police. I feel like this I feel like it's been so long since I've landed in six hundred thousand light years away from Sol, been exploring for a few weeks. Wow. Now that you know what I like about the game is you can actually do that, can't you? Yeah. I know people that have been out for months and even a year doing nothing but exploring yeah and that's you know i just think whoa drive charging. 
I also know people that have been interdicted by aliens. Look, that was a big thing when that came out, and I didn't, I didn't get the, I didn't get the buzz that everybody else was getting because I hadn't been playing it for that long. So I didn't. I understand that you can get in. in, in say it again. <laughs> interdicted. You can get interdicted, but I didn't understand it, so I didn't get the buzz that everybody was getting. You see. Uh huh. I predicted. <laughs> I know. I can't even pronounce it to be honest. Uh, I've got a lot to learn, and you know what? I'll get there. You bet, you bet. Right, so we're on the last jump. I will definitely Great. get there. So somebody says, "Hi, predicted when it's an alien." Ah, Does Here, that make here's the difference. Um, if a player is interdicting you, they're going to interdict you in Super Cruise, right? But a, a real player cannot interdict you when you're jumping from one system to the next right. system. That would be hyperdicting. Right, and, okay. And that's yeah. just not possible. I didn't predict that. Tough. <laughs> <laughs> but apparently that aliens was. can hyperdict you jumping from one system to the next. So we're just coming into this station now. Yep. And I'm guessing, tell me if I'm wrong, 50, but this kind of feels like transporting cargo, right? Well, it kind of does to me because there's not, you're not having to do a great deal different than do, like doing a boom mission. Right. But you're right. getting paid a hell of a, oh, I've still got to do something yet, haven't I? Was he not on be? a sightseeing mission? Uh, we couldn't pick that one up yet because so this it is was... just a straight delivery then yes yes and it paid 200 and something yep I'm happy with that and it's by completing it successfully you are gaining uh, reputation with that faction which gives you one step closer to the requirement of becoming friendly yeah so that you can actually accept one of those sightseeing missions and Junithorn has just come out with the first time I was hyper addicted. I almost popped, I almost pooped myself because it was in <laughs> VR. Now, I know that wow. this game in VR is amazing. Yes, sir. I bet that was something. Try a dolphin or passenger missions. It's a fine ship. Well, for me personally, I've got to build my money up again now, which I'll be able to do now. Yeah. Except for the, what's that one? Mayu and then you got to find where it's for sale at. A location that actually sells the dolphin. Yeah, this game's in VR. Oh, you know what? Toff's going to go to town on this, I can just tell. <laughs> yes, sir, Toff, it is in VR and it is gorgeous. It's amazing in VR. There's actually, a, a, I don't mind, I won't give no names out, but there's an actual streamer that plays this game in VR and he streams it as well. Sure does. I have watched him. And I don't know how he gets it to work on the stream, but he manages it. He uses a program that uh, turns chat into verbal. So he All can right. hear the questions. Yeah, I'm trying to. I have to do it myself now, I remember. Yeah. Landing permission granted. You are clear for approach to pad 28. This is where my track IR would help. <laughs> it would, wouldn't it? Because I can't see right. I can see it, but I'll get it sorted for next time. Yeah. You get days like this. Need to be you have to uh go in below 100 though don't you as well yes yeah i think those vibes are like just under a thousand dollars or something like eight hundred dollars or nine hundred dollars what's that for that's a vr piece of equipment the vibe oh yeah 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 